But sometimes, we don't remember na nandyan siya para sa atin. Sometimes, we find ourselves on the sea of life without Him. And we forget that He knows and that He cares. Now, the followers of Jesus Christ experienced another storm. Naaalala niyo ba ang kwentong to? Like before, there's a little wooden boat of believers in the middle of a great tempest tossed by the waves. But this time, Jesus was not in the boat with them. In the fourth watch of the night, when the sky was darkest and the tempest most fierce, may nakita sila. May papalapit sa kanila. Look! look everybody, look! Tingnan niyo! Ano yan? It's a ghost! Lindo! Someone walking on the water! Ay, naglalap na sa tubig! And then, they heard a voice. Isang boses na kilala nila. Be of good cheer. It is me. Huwag kayong matakot. Peter called out. Jesus! If it really is you, call me. I will come to you. So Jesus called, and Peter came. Now in some ways, if any of the early apostles had a Filipino heart, it had to be Peter. So it's no surprise that he leapt out of the boat. And for just a moment, he was standing on the water. But sometimes, even the strongest, the most courageous of us have moments of doubt, discouragement, and fear. And when Peter saw how high and rough the waves really were, he lost sight of the Savior. He began to sink. As his lips beneath the surface, he cried, Lord, save me! Tonight, if you are one of those who came overwhelmed by the rough waves of life, we want you to remember, you are not alone. Hindi ka nag-iisa. What happened to you, what happened to him, can happen to you. In the dark, churning water of the angry sea, Peter felt a hand. It grabbed him. It was strong. It was Jesus Christ. Walang iba kung di si Jesus. And Jesus held on. Slowly but surely, he lifted Peter up. As Peter fell into the boat, he must have wept for joy. There, in the arms of a loving Christ, the wave stopped, the wind ceased, and hope began to shine again. Even the perfect brightness of hope. Isang ganap na kaliwanagan ng pag-asa. Tonight, we invite you to let hope shine brightly for you. Kung nasaan ka man, anuman ang iyong paniniwala, remember, you are a child of God, a son or daughter of a noble heritage. You have a Filipino heart, a heart of faith, hope, and love. Tonight, if you want to share your hope with the world, I see some, that some of you have their lights open. For those that have not, please turn on the light of your phones. Come on. Hold them up high. Itaas niyo pa. Let your light shine. May this moment and this music be an expression of God's hand holding you and lifting you up. Dahil buhay si Heso Kristo. Because Jesus Christ lives. Sa gitna ng bagyo, siya ang kasama natin. He is with us. And He loves you.